All right, so today we're going to replace the coil pack uh, on uh, the C2009 Town & Country. So on the coil pack that's in here right now, uh, the wires are labeled so 642 along the front and then 315 along the back. And then this, the wires that are on here are labeled as well, so 642, 3, one, five. Um, so pretty confusing, not really any rhyme or reason to why they did it that way, but they did it that way. On the new coil pack, there's not numbers on the coil pack itself, so we'll just match it up based on uh, uh, this one that we're going to take out. So these are 10 millimeters. Let's go ahead and take these two bolts off. loose. So go ahead and change uh, this out. So I'm going to start over here with six. Four. Make sure it clicks into place. Two. And then we'll do the ones on the back. So we got three, we got one, and we got five. So we go ahead and Let's clip it loose with a little wire harness. Just need a slotted screwdriver to pull that loose. And then pull it off. Pop the old one out. Ahead and set the new one on there. Pop the wire harness back on. Slide the lock into place. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and connect the spark plugs. Alright, so along the front we got two, four, six. Along the back we got three and one and then five. And so I'm actually doing this while I'm on vacation, so when I get back, I'm gonna do the plugs and wires, uh, which I would normally do all at the same time. But I'm just trying to do this real quick. Go ahead and put these nuts back on. Up. So there's four holes for some reason, but there's only uh, two nuts. Almost need a deep wall socket for this. A trick you can just take the um, the socket 
off of the uh, ratchet and drop it on there. Since you don't really need to torque these much, it works just fine with a normal size. tight and it's good and in place all right so uh, let's check on the old uh, cool pack ignition cool pack so across across the front we got two four six and across the back we got three one and five and then we'll just make sure they're all seated well So she started up, and so on this uh, on this vehicle, I was getting uh, a few different codes. So I was getting uh, P0301, which is uh, a P0304, which is a cylinder four misfire. Uh, and then after our, uh, I quickly switched out that plug since I was on vacation. Uh, it moved to P. 0301 which is a cylinder one misfire um, and so that led me to believe that the issue was actually the coil pack uh, since it kind of migrated as I was trying to address it and then once I get back I'm actually gonna switch out the uh, the wires and the plugs um, put some iridium plugs in there uh, the dealer the last time they changed when they put um, double platinums in there uh, which lasts about 60,000 miles and it has been about 60,000 miles on this vehicle since those have been switched so that's about it for uh, that quick change of the full pack.